Oh, we have no money. He's not even touching the headboard. Sims, excuse me? Hello everyone and welcome back to another Sims 4 video. Today we are doing something extremely exciting. I have never done anything like this on this channel before, but I love watching those type of videos myself. Today we are going to be combining my two randomized cast challenge characters into one family and seeing if we can play with them in The Sims. So I've made the two of these live together in in a house I created for my five minute build challenge and I just thought that was perfect because everything is so dysfunctional that it's almost going to become perfect. I am also giving these people a zero euro because I want this challenge to essentially be a little bit of rags to riches and a little bit of uh, trying to see if my laptop will be able to run this let's play. <laughs> I want these two to create a family, earn a bit of money so that eventually they can move up in the world and have a child. So then we can create a randomized cast child, which I think would just be hilarious. And it makes me really happy and excited to play The Sims. So that is what I'm going to be doing today. If you like the sound of that, please make sure you're subscribed so you don't miss the next episodes and give this video a like and make sure to ding the little bell so you'll get a notification every time a new episode is live. So this is a Kali Pollock. She is the first character I've created in my randomized cast challenge and she was just uh, throughout that whole video I was literally just uh -huh. sitting like this pretty much like for the whole video like please don't look at me I'm so embarrassed so I wanted to make her a husband uh -huh. and essentially do this whole challenge and his name is Ooh. Michael uh -huh. Lowe La. The thing that actually made me really happy was that they both got a domestic trait naturally, <laughs> which was adorable. So I was like, oh yeah, they're meant to be together. I'm thinking, considering Callie is a foodie, I'm going to get her to join the culinary career and I'm going to get Michael to become... I don't know. We'll see. We'll see whatever he's good at. He's kind of thinking about handcuffs, which makes me think that he wants to be a robber. There's a career in The Sims that you can become like a robber. So maybe we might get him to do that. Who knows? But <laughs> First of all, considering you're going to be in the culinary career, we're going to get you to cook some dinner. So let's just cook breakfast or dinner. Do you not have like, what's happening? Oh, we have no money. Why don't we go on the town? Well, on the town. I mean, let's go over here to fish for some fish. Oh, they're talking to each other. Chat with Callie. That's actually adorable. Could we do the chatting over here while we fish for food by any chance? Look at Eliza Pancakes in the back. Just like, guys, welcome me into your house. Bob over there like, guys, I have fruitcake. Who is this? Gordon Ramsay. I did a video once upon a time where I killed a bunch of random sims and I didn't realize that Gordon Ramsay was still in the world because I thought he died. Maybe we could potentially become friends and, you know, have you cook us some dinner. I run my game on a laptop, which means that a lot of the time you're going to see a little bit of struggle, a little bit of lag. But look, if in the end I'm bored. Okay, well, he still seems to be inspired for whatever reason, but can we please just catch one fish so we can either sell it or else we can cook it do you know what maybe <gasps> michael has got a goldfish and callie has caught a minnow oh my god brilliant okay that's fine but i think i want you to like dig for stuff so that we can sell things this whole fishing thing is just not going to give us that much money is it <gasps> snapdragons snapdragons actually give you a lot of money when you sell them so we might have to plant some of this in our back garden oh there's another snapdragon here oh my god this could be a potential money maker okay surely around here somewhere like you can see this here dig this <gasps> there's some frogs spawning in here look for frogs and we can sell all those items so we can sell this limestone for 50 which is great and we can sell Sell this fish for six so we have 56 euro to our name which i guess is not really a bad thing oh look right behind our house we've been searching all over the flipping neighborhood but there's something right behind our house eggplant frog can i can i see we can now sell this for 10 and we found a treasure map for 80. okay we have 146 euro which i think is absolutely perfect so let's go home <laughs> i have this mod installed <laughs> I don't even know what mod that is, but it lets you poop. Do you know actually what I'm thinking though? Because of the latest pack that I've installed, which is the Bust the Dust Kit. If you'd like to see my review on that, check out that video. I'm going to leave a link down below. But that lets you cheat in the game in the worst way possible. You get these little dust bunnies and they literally pay you like 100 euro a day. So I don't want that. I don't want any kind of Bust the Dust thing inside of this until I'm happy that it is fully fixed. So I've just gotten Ooh, Callie to make us some dumplings. And it's also dinner time and now I want dumplings sure? so we've just invited paolo roca into our house apparently because oh, he doesn't even like him 
Look at him just standing in front of the TV so we can't see anything. It's like we're playing charades. Can you stop just standing there? God, these sims are really stressing me out. Right, so it is now the first day and nothing has happened. I'm just going to keep making her cook so that she learns the cooking skill. Okay, so it says here that he wants to do things like chess art cultural events okay so let's see if we can get him something why is the mailbox inside the house how did i not notice that is there anything we can get him like is there a bookshelf okay i mean if you can read books from this then that would be great let's put that on your bedside locker that's look how cute that is okay we have only 16 so you better be able to read through this okay perfect let's get him to read the Lord of the Swings. <laughs> Let's just cook another meal and then I think I might actually enroll you in a job or get you a job. Enroll you in a job. I'm going to get her get a job so that they can start budding up a solid bit of cash. And then, you know, maybe we might get them. Oh my God, why are you just standing like this? You can sit down on the bed. There was a new update where people can actually relax people. I need to stop seeing people. They're Sims. Sims can now actually relax on a bed. So can we get you to do that instead? Apparently it looks really uncomfortable. Yeah, he's not even touching the headboard. This is a regular bed that came with the Sims and he's not even touching the headboard. Sims, excuse me. They like tested all of the beds that they had, but this one they were just like ah it should be fine no one's gonna cop this and here i am look at him he looks so uncomfortable why are you napping why don't we have a little chat okay do you know what fair enough it's night time they're all like bored out of their heads and they want to sleep so fine go to sleep and we will resume tomorrow i just realized that they can't sleep in the same bed because they're nowhere near even being friends with each other we are going to have to sell something and i, I Okay, so I need 255 for a bed. Are you kidding me? So if I sell this, that's 86. Okay, well, I think we're going to have to take turns. So while he's sleeping, I'm just going to... I can't even see anything. I'm going to get you to come here and dig for things and find frogs so we can afford you a second bed. Because I forgot about the idea that these people are going to have to become friends at least. Or, you know, in my head, they're already going to be in a relationship, but it's become a little harder than that. Oh my God, look at all the food someone made. Sims would just come in and they would just cook random things and leave them there. But I have never seen this much food. Like, that's such a waste. Can I take this? this i can't even take this okay fantastic 145 well wasn't that lucky to get out in the middle of the night to find a rock i think that i think we actually need four euro okay i found something to dig quickly oh. great look a time <gasps> Perfect. Okay, get home. See, this is great. Now I can get her a bed so she can go to sleep. I can even get her the Mod Pod sleeper. Okay, there we go. And we can put this in between them so it's like a divide. I like this one, actually. Can we change the color of this? Yeah. Brilliant. Look at you. You are wrecked, but at least you can sleep. I'm quite proud of myself because in the first day, we have bought ourselves a second bed. Which has kind of thrown us back a little. Okay, I need to put this food away because it's going to go off. Oh my god, it's already spoiled. Hurry up. I'm bored. I think what I'm going to try save up for is um, a chess table so that he can go into like a logic kind of career. I might get these people out, you know, to the park. See if they can actually get on. Okay, sleep faster, please. Okay, you're done. You're fine. What we're going to do... Oh my God, it's raining. I was going to get you out to the park. It's always when you actually want to do something that this happens. We're going to get you to join a career. And I'm thinking let's give Callie the culinary career. Yeah, let's just do that. Assistant dishwasher. <laughs> When do you start? Tuesday at 9. Okay, so tomorrow. Fine. Fair food and mixed drinks. Okay, we can do that. Jeez, that scared me. Okay, so at least we have a job for one of them. You don't even try to hang out with me. Are you too good for me now? Yeah, now that you have an assistant dishwasher job, are you too good for me, Callie? You were just at my house yesterday. Will you calm down? Why are you cooking? We have no money and you decide to waste four euro on cooking when we have food left over. Why do you hate Eliza? <laughs> I mean, of course, we all hate Eliza, but oh my God. <laughs> Please don't, do not, do not. Okay. <sighs> First of all, it's Callie that should be cooking. So you're going to resume the mac and cheese and you are going to go to the toilet, please. Oh no, I need to vote. If we don't vote on these neighborhood action plans, they will just give you something really weird like the stealing one. Okay, tech support is also winning, but I need 10 points. So let's just have a chat. Because you can get these, um points by chatting to people so okay let's just get to know Callie let's actually like
like talk to each other for once. Flirt? No, not Squabble. yet. Nah. This is going way Overtop. too fast. Oh, Pimpini. Loving a birthday party. Would you like to come? Yeah. Let's okay, go. let's go to his birthday party. Oh, okay, so yeah. we got invited <laughs> over to Paolo's We're birthday so party, which is adorable. I love it. Maybe let's get ourselves a drink, even though we have seven euro to our name. Okay, well, so let's try and meet some people. Who is this? Mortimer. Hey. Are these all birthday gifts? Oh my god, this is actually so cute. Okay, let's huh. become friends. She's glitching. <laughs> my game was like, I really can't take this. Stop it. Let's become friends with Kodo. Kado. Oh my god, there's so many Sims. This is so cute. Okay, look. Let's become friends with all of these people. Jay Huntington the second. Third. Jay Huntington the third. Okay, let's become friends with you because you sound like you have a lot of money and you could help us out. Who are you, Jay Huntington? I've never heard of you before. Okay, well, I guess they are becoming best friends. Yes, I do. Why are you getting on with strangers more than you are with your actual housemate? Um, can we get to know this rich person, please? Oh, look at us. We have friends. This is actually adorable. So next time when we have parties, we can all come to our house. Actually, no, let's not come to our house. Realistically, let's not invite anyone to our house. You know what? Maybe we should take this opportunity to, like talk to each other to like discuss interests you know really get to know each other um because we live together and all that uh you're just doing some sit-ups great look at them getting on so well guy over there is not having a great time though look at him he's like jesus christ why did i even come here like does she know all these traits about him already like is this actually what she knows so callie thinks he's basic looking which is okay i kind of want the two of them <gasps> happy hour oh my god that is so scary. That is so scary. That's the bartender. I'm kind of thinking, why don't the two of us, like, you know, go out of here? Like, let's look at this lovely, like, ocean over here. Okay, let's the two of us come here. I want just the two of you just to come over here, have a little chat just on their own without, like, you know, all the talking over each other of the party, you know, like, just, they're just escaping, the two of them. Just have a little chat. But you can also fish while you're here because we only have seven euro. While the two of you are here, you can just, you know, chat really... <laughs> Just, you know, open up a little. That's not what I meant by open up a little. Jesus, God, these people are horrible. They're doing all the things they actually want to do. Oh, he's showing her photo. He's probably like, see, this is my hometown. This is where I came from. And she's like, ha ha, ha, ha. Why don't you guys... Build a sand sculpture together. She's like, uh, you know I had to buy a separate bed because you took up the whole bed last night? Uh, you're meant to be building this with her. Oh no, I forgot about the voting. Oh no, Jewish community received the most votes. That means that everyone's literally just gonna be drunk all the time. No, I can't believe I forgot. But look how adorable these two are. They're literally just building a little sand sculpture right next to like this weird plant. But look, like just look at the view behind them and all. Aren't they just the cutest people? I thought they hated each other at the start of this episode and I was like, this is never going to work. But it actually ended up working pretty nicely. Well guys, I think I might leave this video here please let me know what you thought of this video if you've got any suggestions of what we should get michael to do as a job please let me know down in the comments i would really appreciate that make sure to subscribe to this channel if you ding the little bell down below that's also going to let you know when i upload the second episode of this challenge i'm so excited to pursue these two people as you know maybe something more than just friends and see where a life takes them so yeah please let me know if you've enjoyed this video and share it with anyone else that you think might like it and yeah i will see you in the next episode Bye!